the Associated Press observed more than 130 players around the NFL kneeling or sitting during the national anthem in the league's first nine games on Sunday morning and early afternoon. The highest total was 35 protesters at the Denver at Buffalo game, while no one sent her knelt at the Pittsburgh at Chicago game, although the Steelers stayed in the tunnel. Here's a breakdown at each game, as observed by AP reporters, Cleveland Browns at Indianapolis Colts, about 24. New York Giants at Philadelphia Eagles, at least three, and three other players raising their fists. Denver Broncos at Buffalo Bills, about 35, including Bills RB Lessian McCoy and about half of the Broncos roster. Tampa Bay Buccaneers at Minnesota Vikings, at least two, including Bucks WRS Mike Evans and Asian Jackson. Houston Texans at New England Patriots, about 60. Miami Dolphins at New York Jets, at least four, including Dolphins WR Kenny Stills and Otlar Emmy Tunsil. New Orleans Saints at Carolina Panthers, about 12, including Saints RB Adrian Peterson. Atlanta Falcons at Detroit Lions, about 10, including Lions RB Amir Abdullah. Pittsburgh Steelers at Chicago Bears, the Steelers stayed in the tunnel, although Army veteran Alejandro Villanueva stood outside the tunnel with his hand over his heart. Baltimore Ravens vs. Jacksonville Jaguars in London, about 24, including Ravens Pounds Terrell Suggs and Jaguars RB Leonard Fournette. Total, 130. The amount of protests around the NFL ballooned this weekend in the wake of President Donald Trump's criticism of players who protest during the national anthem. Only four players were observed kneeling or sitting last weekend, and two others raised their fists.